G'day, welcome to Matt's Workshop. Today I'm going to show you how I made this t-shirt with this iron-on transfer. It's a product from Trotec, which is called Laser Flex. Now Laser Flex comes in a lot of different colours, and they sent me this sample to try, but uh, they have not uh, endorsed nor are they in sponsoring this video. So this is their website where I ordered it from. You can see here that uh, laser flex uh, can be ironed on to all sorts of things, including this tote bag. They've got the yellow, comes in a whole range of colors. And obviously they've sent me the green to try out. And um, it's uh, very thin. Basically uh, the laser will engrave the components that you don't want to see um, on the iron-on. So I'll give you an example of that. Uh, I've designed here in, uh, in Lightburn. I'll just open the file. Um, uh, is it? Okay, so uh, what I've done is uh, you can see here I've uh, flipped the image because it's going to be ironed on, so it needs to be flipped. I've also put this uh, border on the outside so that it keeps it all together. And uh, just do a scan image of that. You can see all that black section will be engraved out of the, uh, the green. Uh, so just leaving this white section to be ironed onto the t-shirt. So uh, one mistake that I did make was I didn't quite make this wide enough. I think I made it seven and a half. Reading the instructions later said at least eight. I think it can probably even go a little bit further just to help with taking off the backing paper after ironing it on. So I've set this up, just my logo, um, and like I said, we've got the white sections, which will be green, and the black sections, uh, which will be uh, the colour of the t-shirt that I'll be seeing, seeing through. So, uh, just to give you an idea on the speeds and things that I'm running, i am set the, uh, the speed at 350 millimetres per second, and that is, um, I'm using an 80 watt laser machine. The maximum power I've set is 35% and the line interval is 0.05 millimeters. Um, so that's the scanning and the engraving section. And for cutting, I have selected uh, 15 millimeters per second at 30% power. So because uh, I want to scan, I've actually set this up so that we've got the cut very close to the, um, the scan section. I think if I was to do it again in the future and do another version of this, I would actually have this uh, outside one, I'll just take that off, um, move this one, so outline probably another four millimeters will be fine, uh, and then convert this one to a cut line. So I'll convert that to cut and this to scan, so that it will actually burn those off and just cut along the edge on the inside. Um, so that's what we're, uh, we're looking at there. All the black will be engraved and the white will be left behind. But we'll have a cut, which you actually can't see happening, but there's a cut happening right at the end, just a few millimetres on the inside. Just helps with taking it off at the end. Maybe not as far as I've got it here in this diagram, but anyway, I'm going to show you uh, the, uh, the scanning and how it's engraving.
So thanks for visiting Matt's workshop. It's been a uh, just a short little project making this t-shirt using the iron-on transfer from uh, Trotec called a, a Laser Flex, and uh, that product was um, uh, sent to me uh, just to try out. Now um, I used uh, Lightburn in this project, as you know, um, and um, I've also got the information here on Laser Flex. You can visit them at www.engraving-supplies.com.au and if you look under the laser materials, under the foil sticker, you'll find Laser Flex. They also have a lot of other project uh, products which I've been using in my videos, uh, which I will be using in my videos, and um, they include uh, some of the acrylics, including the, the color gloss and the color mirrors, and you'll see some of those projects uh, that I've made um, with um, on my website which is uh, mattsworkshop.net um, on that page you'll find uh, links to the YouTube videos some of the products that I've been doing I'm doing some pet tags just to get some cash flow uh, and uh, you'll find there the project gallery which um, I'm just uploading slowly just bits and pieces different jobs that I've been doing uh, so uh, doing some engraving on uh, wedding boards um, I'm making these heart boxes which have been fun and uh, some of these projects I may make videos on not 100% sure which ones I'm going to be doing but uh, the laser has been running flat chat as I've been doing all these videos um, and products so uh, Christmas is coming up we've been doing uh, a lot of engraving on tops of glass jars etc and uh, also making things like the wooden hinge um, box uh, which is great for storing um, uh, photos in. It's got a, a living hinge out of the timber, so the timber will bend closed. Lots of name signs, things like that, and uh, using the mirror gold and the mirror silver. So uh, if you haven't already, um, just don't forget uh, you like the video, share it if you like, but also subscribe. Uh, by subscribing and putting the notification bell on, you'll uh, get notified when I update my videos. So yeah, it's been uh, been a bit of fun and I uh, hope you've enjoyed watching and until next time, take care. Cheers.